Thank you for coming so quickly. I just got back into the city, and when I arrived here, I found blood all over the place. I am terrified for my daughter, Sophia. Her passion was playing the piano, and she's only 14 years old. Please, you have to find out what happened to her and where she is. Mr. Sakamura, I understand how worried you must be. Rest assured, I'll do everything in my power to find your daughter and get to the bottom of this. Can you tell me more about Sophia, the situation? Of course, Wyatt. Sophia's mother passed away a few years ago, and since then, she's been staying alone in this apartment most of the time. I have to travel frequently due to my work, and I haven't been able to spend as much time with her as I'd like. She was a really shy girl, and I worry that her introverted nature might have made her vulnerable to something sinister. I understand, Mr. Shaka. The more information we have about Sophia, the better our chances of locating her. Are there any friends or acquaintances she might have spent time with recently? She didn't have many friends, to be honest. Her life revolved around her piano and music studies. I'm afraid I've been too focused on my career and haven't been the best father to her. But right now, that doesn't matter. I just want to find her safe and sound. And we'll do our best, Mr. Sakamoto. Any small detail could be vital in this investigation. Is there anything else that you can think of that might help us in our search? Yes, there's something else. You can stay here as long as you need, and feel free to use any resources you require for the investigation. Money is no object in finding my daughter and understanding what happened to her. Cooperation is greatly appreciated, Mr. Sakamoto. Start right away and keep you informed of any developments. Please, try to remain calm and patient during this process. Thank you, Wyatt. Your dedication means a lot to me. However, I have to leave now, as I need to make some arrangements. Please keep me updated on any progress, no matter how small the detail. Keep you informed every step of the way. Don't worry. I won't rest until we find your daughter. If you remember anything else, or to reach me for any reason, don't hesitate to contact me. I won't, Wyatt. I trust you in your skills and abilities. Find my daughter, and I'll pay whatever it takes. Please. Bring her back to me safe and sound. I promise you, Mr. Sakamoto. I'll do my best. Take care. We'll be in touch soon. Oh my god. Well, we're officially in. Begin your investigation by searching for clues. Alright, everybody, welcome to Supernormal. Now, first impression is. Oh my god, <laughs> this game looks realistic. I might as well be in this room right now. This is actually super impressive. You can turn the lights on and off using light switches. Okay. Uh, well, we just talked to the father. Looks like there's a light switch over here, I believe. Oh, that's a turn it off. Okay. Well, we already got some light, but how do we turn on these lights here? Going on over here real quick. Now... You may have gotten the impression that um, this is a bit of a scary game. And let me tell you what, I can confirm that. Now, his daughter's missing. We don't know what the deal is there. If she's alive, is she hurt? Is she gone? Is she passed? Is she a spirit? We're going to find this all out. But I will give you a warning. This is a bit of a scary game. There may be jump scares, and potentially even some very disturbing themes. Alright, well, one thing I do know from the trailer is there's a laptop here that we could work with. Also, the game can listen to us. Uh, there's some sort of book here that says a worrying. I'm not going to hop on the laptop just yet. We're going to look around the room a little bit. I don't know what this says. Maybe somebody can translate in the comments. Got some wood down there. Some more books. I don't know what that means. Some are sicker than others. Another book. 
this plant, uh, well, I guess it kind of looks alive. I don't know if that's real or not. I'm just trying to see, you know, this is one of those games where... Why is it making weird sounds? That's creeping me out a little bit, guys, I gotta admit. Um, it's one of those kinds of games that I think, you know, there could be some very important clues hidden in plain sight. For example, why are there flies all... <gasps> oh. Move the camera to find a clue. To examine it, hold down the zoom button. Keep in mind that there may be more than one clue in a viewpoint. Or viewport, rather. Okay, so if we do this... Ah. Yeah, there's blood on the keys. Bloody handprints in a home where Sophia loved playing piano. It sends shivers down my spine. She was in danger within these walls. I must find out. Yeah, that's not good. There could be more clues here. There is blood over this way, too. This crime scene tells a chilling tale. There's some more over here. Bloody handprints. I miss the piano-loving environment. It's unsettling to think what might have happened to Sophia. I'll leave no stone unturned in my search for answers. Okay, is there anything else here that I'm missing? I feel like I've searched this area pretty well. Uh, I don't see any other potential... I mean, unless this spot is separate? Bloody handprints on the wall in front of Sophia's favorite piano. Haunting scene that demands answers. Okay, is there anything else? Not that I'm seeing. I think we found everything. Unless you could, like, look at the flies or the plant. But I think we've done it all here. Okay, so now we know how to research clues. Oh. Okay. I guess you can't turn on this light from that switch. Maybe- I wonder if these switch locations are gonna be important later. Okay, we got the dining room table on. Nice. Got some fresh limes. Yeah, that's not scary. Why did we have to do this on a night when it's thundering? Okay, we got uh, an oven. Oh, hold on. Is that blood? Another set of dirty dishes with dried blood. A troubling pattern emerges. That looks like little tiny hands, doesn't it? Whoa, there's something back there too. A massive blood trail behind the pot. A clear sign of struggle. Yeah, but how did he get back there? Anything on the drawers? Not that I'm seeing. There's matches. Hidden use matches. Deliberately concealed. Somebody was here, trying to cover their tracks. And more blood, too. Alright, is there anything else here? See, that's what... That's where you, uh... You really have to look around. I got an achievement. I missed what it said. But, yeah, I have a feeling that was an important clue. Do we do anything with these windows? Doesn't look like it. More switches. Do we turn on an outside light with that? Oh, we got more. Look at that. I told you they're little hands. Dirty dishes with dried paint stains. It appears... Someone hastily tried to clean up. More matches. Use matches near the sink. Someone was here recently. I need to find out who. And if they hold any information about the missing person's whereabouts. Okay. And look at that. Little tiny hands. Bloody handprints on the coating board. Chilling sight. This crime scene holds dark secrets. And I won't stop until I find the truth behind these disturbing marks. Oh man, you know this game's gonna be getting pretty scary soon. I just got okay, found all the clues in the kitchen. So we just got all the clues in there. You know what? Maybe we should Oh, hold on. There's a phone off the hook. There's a broken mirror. I'm hearing some sort of- oh, it's a fan. Okay. You could talk, though, in the game. Hold on, let me- let me try, uh... 
Let me try talking real quick. I'm hearing that sound again. Can you hear me? Is my mic working? Can you hear me? Maybe my mic's not set up right. Or maybe it's not willing to listen to me right now. I don't know. Alright, what's the deal with this? Why is this phone off the hook? Super weird. And that's an old school phone. It's not even plugged in. It's really odd. Okay, there's paper in here. Is there anything else that's of note? Another paper as well. Normal pieces of paper. Could be a desperate attempt to hide information. I'll unfold their secrets and see what they're trying to conceal. Hmm. Crumbling pieces of paper scattered around. Could be torn notes or messages. I need to carefully piece them together. You might reveal something significant. Okay, and there's this other one too. Crumbled papers. Discarded like they hold no value. But in this investigation, every detail counts. I'll unfold their secrets, no matter how small. I appreciate his confidence. Okay. We can turn off the lights. Wouldn't it be cool if there was like something- Oh god, I can barely see. <laughs> I was gonna say, like something glow in the dark. Can we- Oh, what does that say? I can't pick these up. Maybe it's something that'll happen, like, over in- What the hell was that? You guys heard that, right? There's more paper! Oh, that's another part of the clue! I didn't even know! Normal papers. Possibly overlooked by others. But, I won't miss a thing. Might be hidden messages or clues waiting to be discovered. Alright, found all the clues near the entrance door. So we know through the achievement that we're now done here. Now something just spoke to me. And it said, I see you. Oh, God. Okay, we got it. Stairs up. Can we open this door? No, we can't. So we can either go upstairs. Oh man, something went down in here. Something definitely went down in here. We got multiple blood prints. Another broken mirror. Blood on the closet board. Hand smudges. A sign of struggle. Huh? Something more sinister? I need to investigate further and find out what happened here. Well, we're working on it. Blood on the flush. Hand smudges. This could be a crucial clue. There's multiple. I need to dig deeper. It's like they either came here multiple times or they flushed it multiple times. Of course, right on the sink. Bloody handprint on the sink. This is no accident. Someone was hurt here. I must follow the trail and piece together what transpired in this place. There's got to be something else. No? I got an achievement. Flushed with evidence. Found all the clues in the bathroom, so it looks like we're good here. I have a feeling that the only other place we could go maybe is up, unless we miss something in these other rooms. Do I have a way to turn on the light here? Do I really have to go up with the lights off? Are you kidding? Oh, at least there's lights up here. Okay. That's not creepy at all. We can't open this door. Oh, man. Something went down here. Oh, come on, man. What happened? Looking for clues, but we know that- oh, there's a pistol! An unexpected sight. Pistol. 
in this case raises serious concerns. We need to be cautious and determine its relevance to the missing person's investigation. Okay, what the hell happened here? A massive blood trail with a handprint on the laundry machine. Surrounded by foul-smelling clothes. Alright, it says found all the clues in the laundry room. So spin cycle sleuth. Can we open this? We turn it off. I don't see any way to. That's not good though, man. I don't think they're doing laundry in there. Alright, let's try going down this hallway. Is that it? I guess that's how they lock it? Can't open this. A little balcony of some sort. Is there another light I could turn on? There's gotta be some clues in here, right? Oh, what are those? Unexpectedly finding a plethora of pillboxes. This raises questions about the family's mental state. I need to examine these closely and understand their significance. Uh, I don't know what these are. I think I would have to Google search them, but maybe you guys know what these are. Yeah, it doesn't really let me do a whole lot. Hold on, there's more pills. Yeah. Found all the clues in the bedroom. I just got that achievement. So I don't know if there's much else I could do there. Now let's just check this little bedroom area. Can't really go past this, it looks like. Unless this will let us. Okay. Well. I think we've done all we can to search these rooms. Maybe we could try talking to this girl. Is anyone here? Not listening. All right, let's go downstairs. Would you guys do this? I mean, if the pay was good enough, would you want to be kind of like a paranormal investigator? Wait a minute. Why is it let me do this? We could look at the fruits and stuff. There's got to be clues here. It's letting us. <gasps> Luigi board on the shelf. Ooh. This case just took an unexpected turn into the mysterious. I'll need to explore its significance and potential connections to the missing person. Oh, come on, man. A pointer for the Luigi board. Right here. This adds a whole new layer of intrigue to the case. How is the phone ringing? It was disconnected. What the hell? Hello? Hello? Are you there? I can't answer it. How is it ringing? There's nothing connected. Turn off the lights. Oh God. Okay. Well, I guess the 
whatever I heard before maybe doesn't like the lights. Let's, uh, let's just try this out first, though. Okay, we got the lights on. Hopefully it doesn't trigger this girl too much. Okay, we could sign in. Oh. What the hell was that? So there's a login and password somewhere. Press and hold the interaction button. Oh, we can't... Okay, we can move it. Got it. Is there a way to zoom? Alright, there's night vision as well. Okay, that's cool. I guess that's me. Okay. Not seeing anything odd. All looks normal. Yeah, it's a hallway. So yeah, we know, we know the layout of, of this place. What? The? Why? She's pointing at the light switch. Is this the daughter? Hello? Do you want me to turn off the light switch? Alright, we need to get out. What the hell? Is, is she just up there in the laundry room? Oh boy. Yeah, I have a feeling that um, things are going to start to go south here. that sound. She's not here. Okay, I'll turn off the light. Please don't jump scare me. I'm leaving. What the hell was that? Hi. We're, we were looking for you. Are you okay? Okay! That's not normal! That is absolutely not normal. Is that blood? Oh my god. I can't control anything. What the hell was that? We're hallucinating. There would be blood right now, if that was real. Voice recognition has been unlocked, and now you can attempt to communicate. So I couldn't talk to her before? Are you friendly? Are you here? Okay. I'm going back down. Do we need to turn off the lights, though? She doesn't like the lights. I'm leaving this on. For right now, because I don't want to be going upstairs with it being pitch dark. So there is a Ouija board. Can I take it? Why is there a Ouija board in the house? Why is it always a Ouija board? Even in Phasmophobia. Are you here? Where are you? I'm gonna turn off this light. What the hell? What happened? Did I just see something? All right, we got to go back on the camera. Go away. Go away. What the hell was that? I'm going on the left top. We're going to look upstairs again. That's where we last saw her. But let's look upstairs. What she she wanted the lights off, right? in here now. 
something in the hallway. First por paranormal clue to the email was found. Oh! You find email. What does that mean? You find email? It wants a login and password. We could type, but I don't know a sign in yet. Maybe we need to use a Ouija board? What's the email password and login? <laughs> Maybe it's on the paper? I can't make out anything there. There's gotta be a clue to the login, right? Maybe I gotta turn off the lights? Alright, let's do it. Oh, God. I don't wanna keep turning everything off. We'll turn off the lights in the kitchen, too. Unless I could use a Ouija board. I know I can't. Alright, let's turn off the lights. Oh my god. Alright, they're mostly off. Oh god, that's so dark now. Come on. I'm gonna turn off the bathroom one too. Jeez. Can we... Can we call in... What the hell was that? Something just happened. There's a light switch. Go away. Can you see me? It's not understanding that. Do something. It's listening. What do you want? Justice? Justice for what? How? How can I give you justice? Can you help me? happening. What just happened? What happened? Can you help me? Can you help me? Leave lights on? <gasps> was that? I thought you wanted the lights off. Oh my god. Oh. What the hell, dude? Is it is it her that wants justice or is it something else? Can you help me? Can you help me? Please. I can't. God, where's our freaking light switches? Where are you? I 
gotta go back on the laptop. Maybe we could catch. I think she's active. Okay, she reacts to sound. If I'm talking, she reacts. Can you help me? You can fix that. Fix what? What can I fix? Did she break something? God, I wish I could interact with this. Oh, there's a flashlight! Oh my god. This whole time we had a flashlight. So this will hopefully help, help us out. Now we can go and not worry about the lights. What the hell was that? the hell? Oh, come on, man! What? No! Did I just die? What was that? What happened? My fault? I turned it off. Okay. Maybe there's going to be a clue in there now with the lights off. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. We got to get our email. Come on, what room was that? 1MA. What is that? So we've got that handprint. 1MA. What am I missing? We we might have to turn off our lights again. Can you help me? Can you help me? Not listening. Let's go ahead and get the lights turned off. Oh my god. Can you help me? Are you here? Is anyone here? Yes. Do something. Said no. That means no. What happened? Something disgusting. Oh my god. Ah. <sighs> Thank you. 
Turning off more lights. Can you see me? Okay, we're going upstairs again. Is this where it all went down? Can you see me? Can you help me? There's got to be something more in here. I can't interact with these medications any further. I don't know what they are, though. Go away. Oh, she left! <laughs> it worked! Sound. Oh, she's back. She wants that turned off. Okay, 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 I'm coming. I'm coming. God. I'm here for you. It's going to be okay. Oh my God. I'm trying to help you! Oh. What do you mean keep this light off? Okay. But you want this light. Alright, there's gotta be a new clue in there, right? She was just there. She was literally just there. Alright, two... RK. One mark. Gotta be another clue here. Can you help me? Can you see me? What do you want? Where are you? She's at the front door. Show yourself. Dude, come on, man. I was being quiet. I was being quiet. Oh, God. I do what the heck do I do what happened murder we're getting more details how can you see me what do you want she's saying that a murder happened here if assuming that she's the one communicating
Oh no. He's back. Uh, what in the hell? What? Oh my god. <laughs> Why? Why? I'm literally trying to help you. Did she fall out of here? Oh my god. What happened? Where are you? She's in here, isn't she? She's inside the washing machine. I still don't understand what this pistol, like, what happened? I'm telling you, there's something going on with this damn washing machine. Are you here? No, I didn't say do something. Are you here? Where are you? Can you see me? What do you want? Something on TV. You guys see what it is? Punish. Punish who? Did I leave that light on in the kitchen? I feel like I didn't. Go away. God! She wants me to- she wants me to turn off the light in the kitchen. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. I knew it! I knew I didn't turn that light on! I knew it! God, I should've known. I have no way to turn this one off, though. At least I know of. Okay. We're gonna get some other clue there. God dang, man. This is creeping me the hell out. I should not be playing this this late at night. The freaking light's off. I need the kitchen cam. 3 2009. Oh, it's telling me the order. Mark 2009. Okay, now I got it. What's the password? Can you help me? Can you help me? What happened? Okay, you already told me that. What's that sound? The sound's changing. Can you see me? Are you here? Come on, man! 
man! For real! What is happening? Can you help me? Where are you? Okay. So it did say the light will guide you. We need to find more lights that are powered on. No. Not this time. Not this time. Not this time. Go away. Okay, find the clue for the password in the bathroom. It says first clue. So mark 2009. One S. Ah, oh, you can see it in the mirror. From a certain angle. So one is S. Oh, that's sneaky. Go away. She left. Okay. Okay, I got you. I got you. Second clue for the password. Five. T. So S. Mm. What the hell? S. T. Is it gonna be stop? Mark. Oh god. S T O P. Stay. Um. S T. What? What else? Um. So Mark two thousand nine. S T. S. I don't know. Where are you? Up above. I thought they told me to keep this on. STW Why was there music playing in here? No. Go away. Oh my god, I don't want to turn around! <laughs> Go away. Show yourself. from here. Where are you? No. ST 
STW. STWD. STWD. Can you help me? Go away. She says no. Go away. She left. The hell? Maybe we don't want her to go away. S T W D E. Oh wait, hold on. Three. Oh no. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta look at the actual order. It's giving it to us out of order. We need to verify. Six? So the, it's a six letter password. So W. S W E. And then a D at the end. So we're missing the fourth letter. Are you friendly? Are you here? <gasps> What? Jesus! What? What? Where are you? Listen. Girl, I swear to God, I'm trying to help you. We got another one. Seven is J. J. Is it sweet DJ? Oh my god, what am I missing? No. I refuse. Go away. Missing something. Oh my god. Girl, please, please. Go away. It's getting crazier. It's getting more and more crazy. Why is this light back on? <gasps> Over here. Is it 
This one? DJ K? What? How many freaking things are there? I think as long as I've got the lights off, it'll keep giving me clues. God dang, dude. What the hell is happening? Show yourself. Go! Are you kidding? What the hell is happening? E. Sweet DJK. Sweet DJK. That's it. Sweet DJK. What? Oh. Sweet PJ. Is that that's a P. P. Oh. It had to be capitalized. We've got the email. Alright, Rachel Maine, it's really nice to meet you too, Mark. Wait, okay, so these are different chats? Alright, hey Rachel, I'm so happy we met here. It's like a super cool adventure. Hiya Mark, I know, right? This app is like magic. Tee hee, I'm bouncing with joy. You're totally right, Rachel. It's like we found a hidden treasure or something. What's your fave ice cream flavor? Ooh, tough question. I can't pick just one, but I'd say chocolate sprinkles and marshmallows, yum. Uh, I agree! Ice cream rocks! I'm a cookies and cream fan, but I like trying all flavors. We should have an ice cream party someday. Yes, ice cream party with all the toppings! It's gonna be the bestest party ever, I just know it! Alright, this is incredibly creepy. Ha ah, you're making me giggle! We should create our fairy tale together, filled with laughter and friendship. Yes, our fairy tale adventure! Let's explore the enchanted forest and find joy around every corner. I'm on board, Mark. This is going to be the best adventure ever. Super duper excited. Me too, Rachel. Let's hold hands and step into this wonderful story together. Here's my phone. Let's meet at my place. Sounds great. Can't wait to meet in person, Mark. Oh my god. She ran into the ultimate freaking creep. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. This is the guy's laptop, I think. These are his chats with numerous girls. All right, hey Chloe, just want to say I really like the selfies you sent me. You look so amazing in all of them. Oh, thanks, Mark. I'm so glad you liked them. I was a little nervous about sending them, but you've made me feel more confident. Are you kidding? You're naturally photogenic. Yeah, this guy's a major freaking creep, dude. You too sweet, Mark. I have to admit, it's nice getting compliments from someone as nice as you. Yeah, dude. Girl, please. These are red flags. Well, it's easy to compliment someone as beautiful as you. Thanks, Mark. Your messages make me smile. So what do you enjoy doing in your free time? Dude, this guy is a creeper. Mega creeper. It's all the same. He gives out his phone number. Deal, we'll be on each other's cheer- Wait, we'll be each other's cheerleaders ready to take you on. Oh my god. And then Martha. Uh, hey Mark. Oh, hey Martha, I remember you. How's it going? I'm doing great. I can't believe we're both 14. And that made me really happy. It's not easy finding people our age on here, you know? Yeah, dude, this is bad. This is really bad. Talk about fantasy series, sci-fi books, soccer. Phone's ringing. It would be more amazing if you come over to my place like Saturday afternoon. Oh my god. Hold on, I'm reading! Amanda Clark, what's your address again? Okay. Uh, okay, we've got an address. 183 Crossroad Street. Pale Green Door. Um... Oh my god, I gotta get to the phone. Alright, she was going over to his house. Uh, hi Mark, how's your day going? Hey Sophia, my day's going pretty well, thanks. God, this is creeping me the hell out. Oh, God. Hold on, please. Yeah, this guy... We gotta listen. High ranking position at company. Your 
mental well-being, especially considering your history of mental illness. It's crucial for you to follow your prescribed medication regimen as it significantly impacts your stability. Please, Mr. Sakamoto, get in touch with me as soon as possible. It's essential that we discuss your situation and get you back on track with your treatment. Thank you, and I hope to hear from you soon. Take care. What the hell? Wait a minute. Okay. The girl is a victim. The girl is a victim. Is it the dad, though? Okay, we didn't get to read that last email. Okay. Um, we gotta read this quick, because something's going on in the house. Uh, my dad works a lot, and he's hardly ever home. But sometimes it gets lonely, and I wish he could spend more time with me. Appreciate you opening up. Uh, must be a tough feeling. Alright, high-ranking position in his company requires a lot of traveling and long hours. I know he works hard for a family, but I miss having quality time with him. It's something that's been on my mind lately. So this guy was giving her this reassurance. I'm here to listen and be supportive. Absolute freaking creeper. Uh, but why are we seeing this? Was he imitating this Mark person? It means a lot to me that you're so understanding willing to listen. Look forward to sharing more. Okay. Feelings mutual. We'll take it one step at a time and see where the journey takes us. And who knows? Maybe we'll find something special. That was perfect, Mark. I can't wait to see what the future holds. Until then, let's keep getting to know each other. This is not freaking good. Let's look at cameras real quick. So we've got all these notes. We've got phone numbers. Okay, we gotta go out. We, we gotta, we gotta scour the house. Can you help me? Look for me, I'll give you hints. We have to find her. Where are you? Where are you? I swear she's in there. This is it, I think. Oh my god, I knew it! Frickin' knew it! You son of a bitch! Fight! No! Oh my god, no! It was him. In the chilling, desolate apartment, the cold body of Detective Wyatt lay lifeless. The seasoned investigator had been ruthlessly silenced, forever stilled, by the very man he had been closing in on. Mr. Sakamoto. God dang it. Wyatt's relentless pursuit of truth, his dogged determination to unravel the grim secrets held within these walls, had brought him face to face with a darker reality than he could have imagined. The horrifying truth was clear. Mr. Sakamoto, Sophia's father, had been the perpetrator behind his daughter's disappearance and the demise of other innocent girls. I knew it! But the revelation had come too late. Wyatt's discovery cut short by a brutal end. When his body was found at the crime scene, the once bustling apartment was now an eerie silence. Mr. Sakamoto, nowhere to be seen. Oh my god. So guys, there, there's multiple endings to this game. There's gotta be a way to get a good ending here. So yeah, this was super normal. Very, very intense. All right, says the journey for Detective Wyatt has only just begun. What lies ahead is bound to leave you breathless. If his first adventure captivated your imagination, don't hesitate to leave a review on Steam. For those seeking deeper mysteries and conversations, join us on Discord. Make sure to drop a follow on X slash Twitter. The shadows hold more stories. Until then, see you in the unknown. So yeah, as far as I know, there are multiple endings. I will look into this and see if there are. If so, that means that we got potentially a bad ending. I'm going to go ahead and explore this further. If you guys want to see more of Supernormal in the event that there's more to tell, be sure to leave a like, leave me a comment down below, and share this with your friends. Let them know about this game. Very cool experience. And unfortunately, this is a, a story that isn't quite so much a story. Be safe out there. Look out for others. There's a lot of creepy weirdos out there. And sometimes really terrible things happen just from answering a simple message.
you never really know who's on the other side. But that's going to do it for Super Normal for this episode. Again, if there's more to it, I will jump in if you guys want to see more. But thank you so much for watching this episode. I really appreciate it. Stay tuned for more content here on the channel. But for now, thank you again for watching. I'll see you all next time.